Hey everybody and welcome to another edition of Lane Side Reviews. And on this episode, we're going to be looking at Hammer's Viral Solid. Alright guys, so welcome back. As always, I'm the Bearded Beast, Rob Johnson, joined once again by Scoops Porter. As we said, we're looking at Hammer's Viral Solid. Now, we were lucky enough to get this ball basically right from the bag of our good friend J.R. Raymond. So not only do we get an insight into Hammer's performance, but we get to see how it was laid out for tour and what staffers throw. So why don't you tell us a little bit about the ball, Scoops? This is in their mid-performance line. It's got the Violent Flip Reactive Solid cover stock and the Vibe Core, which is a symmetric core. It is a skid flip motion with a strong mid lane read, and it's for medium light oil. But as you'll see in the video, we got a little bit more than we bargained for. So rather than listening to him talk about it, why don't we take it lane side and see how it's stacked up. All right, so we have Wayne Porter here, our low-speed, low-rev player. Yeah, he's bowling a Kegel Main Street oil pattern. Uh, now, in the intro, <laughs> you might have alluded to this ball maybe not being as weak as they advertise. Yeah, I'd say this ball is medium oil because when they say it picks up in the mid lanes, it picks up in the mid lanes, but it's still got that the skid flip motion you want, but man, does it ever start grabbing early. Now, this ball came right out of uh, J.R. Raymond's bag, and uh, it was laid out with uh, not a lot of distance in the yeah. fronts and a slow transition. So you would think that it would it would kind of roll and then be rolling out and kind of blot yeah. in the pocket. Yeah, it didn't happen. <laughs> um, for lack of better saying, I mean, it... It rolled strong, and I think because it's the slower response to the friction, um, it didn't get as snappy and angular. It smoothed it out, and it just – I was so surprised. I was ready – well, you'll see here. I We, we thought this was going to be a medium to light oil ball, and wow, I had to move deep. No, and what was that? That reaction there too. It <laughs> continues. Like that's the I thing. I think that was the four pin that oh, hit the eight I, from behind. I don't know. It was crazy. <laughs> like this ball, it's such a strong carry, um, such a beautiful motion. Like wow, just I I really I I enjoyed this ball a lot more than I thought I was going to. I'm not gonna lie. Well, yeah, we I mean we put out fresh oil and we expected. Yeah. I mean, watching you guys shoot this, I expected yeah. it to be very long yeah. and flop in yeah. because but, it's supposed to be a medium yeah, light. Yeah, and man, <laughs> I had to get into 15 with this ball and just get it out. Like, just wow, look at that. That's I've thrown other companies' higher-end equipment close to the same spot as this on a similar shot. And it does – I mean, it looks wow. like you're playing in your favorite spot, that 15 yeah. to 10 – with yeah, a strong yeah. roll. And look at the pin carry. Just for a medium light oil ball, this is a <laughs> The confusion very good, on your face. Yeah. I thought this was light oil. Yeah, it's wow. Now here's Jim Mack, our uh, high speed, high rev player. And this does not look like a light oil ball in his hands. No, no. It's the same thing. Because of the way the drilling is, it's, it's grabbing just a little bit sooner. And wow, look at the... Like, he's getting it down further because, no. whoa. <laughs> um, Turn four. Yeah. <clears throat> his speed is a lot higher than mine, so he's getting it to get down lane a little bit better. Um, and his rev rate. So, like, just this is just me. Wow. Whoa. 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 I drove through the yeah. pocket so much it was almost a 7.9. Seven, nine. Yeah. Wow. That pin carry is, like, it's very continuous, too, and very strong, which is just a great motion. You got one a little deeper, a little further out, boom, still made it back strong. So uh, what's your opinion of this as a medium to light oil ball? I mean, given that it's a strong layout. Yeah. Um, I think it would be good if um, with maybe with a slightly different uh, layout, but it's definitely on the medium side. I wouldn't put it towards the, the light for sure. All right, guys, that about wraps it up for another show. 
If you like what you saw this episode and want to find out more, don't forget to follow us on Facebook at Laneside Reviews. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel, and you can follow us on Twitter and Periscope at Laneside Reviews. And don't forget to use this coupon code to pick up your jerseys at LogoInfusion.com. So until next time, guys, we'll see you Laneside. This program is sponsored by Turbo, driven to bowl, for all the quad two inserts and interchangeable thumbs we use in all of our videos. Dexter Bowling Shoes, the world's most advanced bowling shoe, the SST8. Bowlerama Berry, for all the lanes we bowl on. For birthday parties and corporate events, call now. Still searching for that perfect fit? With no residue and easy removal, Real Bowler's Tape really is the Real Bowler's choice. Plantronics Rig, stereo headset and mixer. Play more, pause less. And Logo Infusion, look the best, be the best, infuse your game, Logo Infusion.